Welcome back, everybody, to uh, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. I'm an old guy gaming, and we're picking up right where we left off. Okay, so if you guys did not catch the last episode, uh, we had we had quite the fight here. We had to we had to kill, um, uh, you know, a, a, an officer, a trooper, and then an, a, a purge trooper. Uh, and they wear black armor, kind of Darth Vader looking, and they have, like, these really nasty electro baton things. And uh, that was a, actually a very hard fight. Uh, but we finally got through it after about five attempts or so, I think it was, five or six maybe. And uh, so we're picking up right at that spot, and we're heading on out. Let's do this. Oh, look! This is right back where we started from. Okay, good. Well, the first thing we're going to do is save. Oh, that guy's still over there. And he's angry! And we got two skill points. My goodness, okay. Let's rest first. And that means that we can now take this, um, this one. Wait, no. Yeah, this one. Holding slow allows Cal to slow all targets around him. See, now that would have been useful in that fight for sure. Uh, so let's take it. Oh, uh, yeah. See how handy that's going to be? Man. So I could have slowed both of those guys at the same time. Got a couple of wax off on them and then, you know, wash, rinse, and repeat. That's a that's a powerful skill right there for sure. Awesome. Okay. I don't know if we need to save again after doing our skills. Probably not, but let's just do it again just to be on the safe side. All right. Next up is... We never did go in that thingamadoodle there to see where it went. So maybe we'll do that next. I don't really want to fight this guy again if I don't have to. Of course, he probably gave me lots of XP. Run away! Oh shit, he's right there! Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm glad he can't come down here. Oh, I didn't dodge quite soon enough there. Hey, cut that out, man. These guys are tougher than they look, man. I'll tell you what. Hey, yo. Uh. Here, let's do this. Watch this. Oh, I was hoping I could push the rocket back at him. Hey, rude. <laughs> Cut that out! Damn it. Okay. Seer, I'm under an Imperial dig site. You got a lot further than we thought. We can't worry about that now. The Empire's identified you as the Jedi from Bracca. They're searching for the Mantis as we speak. Can't you move the Mantis? It's too risky to start the engine. Its power discharge will draw their attention immediately. I'll be back as fast as I can. Hmm. If this is the way out, we didn't go the other direction with those spinning discs. I'm starting to wonder if it is because, you know, we got the little sound bite there. Okay, hold on. Can we... Can we go back down? Alright, you know what, you guys? Um... I think I'm gonna deliberately die because... I don't know if I'm going to be able to go back to where we were. Hmm. Well, what should we do? Oklahoma, what should we do? Should I die and go back, or should we just continue on and see if we can get back there later? What do you think? I mean, this little slide thing, you might actually go back down there anyway. 
Well, let's... Yeah, let's continue on. I agree. I don't like to die on purpose. That's kind of kind of cheesy. Lord knows I I, I die without trying to <laughs> enough times, you know. To, then we don't need to do it deliberately too. Okay, so this is probably locked, or not. He's a long time friend of mine, and he wishes he was a dwarf. Everybody, welcome Varg oh. to the channel. How you doing, man? Yeah, that does get us back to our ship. And he wants us to scan something. I'll check Scout it out. Scout Trooper Baton. Yeah, a stick with shocky stuff on the end that hurts us. That's what that is. Okay. All right, well, here. Oh, oh. What was that? Oh, that was the door closing. Welcome, Varg, to the stream, buddy. Yeah, Jedi never surrender. Exactly. Exactly. Okay, let's do this. Uh, no, let's not do that. <laughs> oh, this is not easy. Okay. Holy shit. Okay. Do I need to jump? There we go. Oh, man. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, come on. No, nope, too soon. Too soon. There we go. Oh, no. I think I'm jumping a little too soon. Because I'm trying to... There we go. I'm trying to get the sprocket thing down first. Ah, oh, shit! This is hard! Oh, yeah. Okay. We got this. We got this. Yeah, see, it does take us back down here. Woo! Maybe we can beat him. Ah! I should move back. Oh, oh. Jedi. Fight me. All right, so, hmm. I guess they gave us that pathway back down here in case we press this and went up when we weren't ready to. Maybe, you think? Okay. Help! All right, you need to slow down so I can do that. All right, so let's see. Um, let's go this way. So this little slide thing is probably going to bring us back after we go through go that pathway. Is my guess. Are we sure we can't push him off the cliff? Nope. Whoa! He didn't like that, did he? We're getting the crap kicked out Close of us one. here. Okay, let's do this. Let's go back up this way. And run over here. Time means everything, man. Especially when you have giant sprockets. Spinning at high speed, going down ice slides. Time means everything. Jump before I slow down? Well, I think part of my problem was I was jumping too soon. So I wasn't actually getting through the loop. So you have to, is, it, you have to walk and chew gum at the same time, because you had to time, you know, the opening of the sprocket, but then you also had to time the jump too. So it was, it was tricky. We, did, we got it done though. Run away! Run away! Oh shit! He's right there! Whew! Okay. Huh. 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 Huh.
Cut that dude in half. Oh, man. Whoa, whoa. Easy, big guy. Easy. Okay, so... Oh, oh, ow. I hit the wrong thing. Oh, <laughs> shit. Okay. We got this. Oh, shit. Maybe? Maybe? Whew! Okay. We got this. S comp link must be repaired. I don't even know what the hell that means, man. I'm, I'm sure we'll find out eventually. Whew! Alright, so we got another elevator here. Anything else? Alright, here we go. That's right, being a Jedi ain't easy at all, man. It's not a walk in the park. But we got this. Varg, do you have this game or Oklahoma? Do you either one of you guys have it? It's a lot of fun, man. I'm really, really enjoying it. Really, really enjoying it. It reminds me of the old, uh, in some ways, uh, of the old, you know, uh, Jedi Rebel or Jedi Outcast, you know, with Kyle Katarn and them and that guy. But it also has a lot of Tomb Raider in it. It's got a lot of Dark Souls in it and a lot of, you know, Drake's Fortune. So oh. all, in, all in a good way, of course. I'll check Excavation it out. equipment. Um, here. Imperial Excavation equipment, the level of dust suggests it's been sitting here for a long time. It does look a little bit dusty, doesn't it? Okay. So that's our ride back home. Alright, we've got a force echo and a save point. Let's do the save point first. Just because you never know. You never know what might happen. A sense echo. That's killed by a cave -in. Imperial excavation is making these tunnels unstable. Cave in. Remains of a stormtrooper killed when the tunnel collapsed due to an imperial excavation. Okay. Anything else up here? Got a doorway. S comp link. Okay. All right, I think, I don't think we have to do that force sense thing again after saving, but let's save it again just in case. I can't remember for sure. All right. More slippery slide. It's a slippery slope. Whoa. Oh, that one was that one was easy mode compared to that other one. Goodness. I won't back down. Okay, don't back down. Just slow down. Okay, shoot me, bro. <laughs> that blew up the thing. That was awesome. All right, I think we're done here. I think we're done here. Let's head on up.
Terrace Kasi is an easier class to play in SWG, Star Wars Galaxies? Are you talking about the, uh, the, mul the massive multiplayer games, Varg? My kids played that. I never really played it myself, but my kids played it. I did play um, Knights of the Old Republic, though, and really enjoyed that game. I don't know. I don't remember if I played two or not, but I know my kids did. All right, guys. I think we are finished with this planet because our ship's just right outside the door there. So we need to go to Kashik, Kashik, the Wookie planet. Is it Kashik or Kashik? Come on. There we go. Oopsie. I don't think that was supposed to happen. Um. I was going to say something. I can't remember what it was now. Cal, we've got a walker firing on us, and our weapons are down. Oh, shit. Is that him? Tell him he better get his butt. <laughs> Hold on. I'm on my way. Oh, shit. Oh, no, 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 no. Not good, not good, not good. Ah! Can I... Can I block his blaster bolts? Oh, I can. Okay. Get away, get away. Okay. Ah, shit. Oh, oh, jeez. Okay. Uh, Speedy, thank you very much for the follow, man. Appreciate it. Welcome to the channel. We just got thrown into a... A fight with a... What's it called? ATST? And, uh... I wasn't expecting it! <laughs> okay. So, let's see. Can we... Let's just bypass these guys, because I don't want to take a chance of taking any damage. we got to save our full thingamadoodle for this guy. Back up, back up, back up. Okay. This stuff's probably going to get destroyed here. Shit, that hurt. It's 
Just him. Now. Okay. We gotta stay away from those. Oh shit, I didn't see that. Oh damn, we killed him too! <laughs> Not fair! Not fair! I didn't even see that. He dropped that grenade right in my mouth. Son of a bitch! Okay, we got this. We got this. I mean, we we could actually probably kill him by just deflecting his bolts if we just time it right. That's bullshit though, man. I killed him. What the hell? Okay. Ah, run away from those guys. No, 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 no. I don't have time for you. Alright, we got this. We got this. I didn't time that right, did I? There we go. Oh shit! So it looks like he does his laser burst in groups of three. Okay, let's do a slow. Take a couple whacks and then get away. Oh shit. Okay. We gotta stay away from those grenades. Oh shit, I'm hitting the wrong button. Darn it. Okay, let's Toss pop it. one of these just to... Oh shit, run away! Okay. Ah shit! Oh shit. Woo! Okay. <laughs> that was funny, man. That guy pops out, it's like, uh, you're dead. Okay. Awesome, man. That was fun. That was fun. Uh, all right. Let's do this. Nice work out there, kid. Hey, you got some real moves on you. <laughs> Just tell me that this visit wasn't for nothing. I found the tomb of a Zepho Sage. They definitely used the Force. An advanced civilization of force wielders who mysteriously vanished. No wonder Master Cordova became so obsessed with them. What else did you find? Before they disappeared, the Zeppo journeyed to the planet Kashyyyk. Oh. Kashyyyk. Cordova had a Wookiee friend named Tarful. Maybe we can find him. Kashyyyk, I look, things are really bad down there. The, the Empire's muscling in on those Wookiees big time. Then we better get ready for a fight. Oh. <laughs> I love that guy, he's awesome. I think this lifestyle suits you. Fighting that walker seems to have made you more confident. So, how are you holding up? I mean, with the Force? Yes, with the Force. I know you said it could be overwhelming. I haven't gotten myself killed yet. I'd rather not talk about it. Yeah, well, I understand. More than you realize. Well, why'd you choose to stop using the Force? When the purge started, and our 
clone troops turned against us. My Padawan and I took several younglings and we went into hiding. But we didn't last long. Imperial Patrol was about to discover our location, so... I tried to lure them away from my Padawan Trilla. She stayed behind with the younglings. But they caught me. And they tortured me. They wanted to know about the others and how many were left, but mostly they wanted to know about Cordova and where he went. But you escaped. No. It was a prison riot. I saw my opportunity and I took it. But they almost broke me. And I am not the same as I was, Cal. Your Padawan. Did she survive? No. But that's why we can't give up. We can't let the sacrifice of those closest to us be for nothing. Siri's Padawan, or actually Seer, that's how you pronounce her name, Seer. Uh, Seer shares an awful memory about her past. During the Jedi Purge, she was captured and tortured by the Empire. She was able to escape, but her Padawan was not so lucky. Years later, the event has left her scarred and reluctant to use the Force. Yeah, tragic story. Okay, let's talk to her some more. Please, I'm trying to collect my thoughts. Okay. We got a new seed that we found, so let's plant that. Those things are getting big. Uh, Kelpie Gillipod. Okay. I'm not sure what the benefit of this is going to be ultimately, but uh, I guess we'll find out. I have to, I have to think it's we'll probably get something from this other than it just being for funsies. Maybe it is just for funsies. So I don't know. There's nothing wrong with that. Okay. Well, um, let's see. We've got something. We got to talk to our. Our captain over here. So we're still here. Let's go up here for a second. Uh, we do have some new lightsaber uh, parts and thingamadoodles. So let's look at that first. Okay, so let's see. Um, I think, yeah, we still only have green and blue for color. I kind of like green. We still only have one emitter. We have two switches, though. Duty and Resolve. Valor and Wisdom 2. I still like this one the best. I still like this Jaro Topal one the best. Uh, sleeves. We have three sleeves. Elemental nature. Oh, okay, so these are actually intended to go with each other. That's cool. Hmm. Okay, what about material? Oh, that's cool. Copper. Os Osmer Osmeridium? Never heard of that. Sylvian iron. Or Cerakote? I don't think any of this stuff does anything. It's just cosmetic, but it's kind of fun, though. I kind of like this Osmeridium. Let's do that. And... Does either one of these sleeves go a little bit better? Well, I don't think they really do. This one, maybe... I still think that one looks the best. Now, I like I still like that one the best too. Okay, I think that's all we can do with our lightsaber. Hopefully we'll be able to fix up the the uh you know if you if you look at the here, let's do this again. The back end of it, it's all like jacked up here however i don't know this for sure okay but i think at some point 
we're going to be able to turn this into a double lightsaber. I don't know that for sure, though. Because it almost, this would suggest that there was, you know, another, a, a, a double side to this and, you know, it got ruined or something. So, I don't know. We'll see. If you guys do happen to know, don't tell me. Don't tell me. Don't give me any spoilers. I don't know. I'm not even exactly sure why I think that, but there, I, I read something or saw something somewhere, so, somewhere that leads me to believe that that might actually be the case. All right, let's do a meditation here. And we're also out of time, too, so this would probably be a good time to wrap up the episode. But let's do our skill first before we do that. All right, so we have one skill point, and... Cal regains more force when he defeats an enemy and regains some force when he hits a blocking enemy. So, you know, that's going to be useful, too, because that's going to help us get more force back. Um, I don't want to completely ignore these other ones, though, too. So... Waiting longer to press attack after Cal swings his lightsaber allows him to perform a special attack with increased range. Hmm. Okay, well, let's look over here for a second. Cal recovers additional life when using a stim canister for... Oh, that's going to be handy. And just even maximum life. Cal automatically deflects blaster bolts when he is sprinting or wall running. Oh my goodness, that would be handy too. I mean, all this stuff is good. I don't, I don't see anything here that sucks, you know, or that appears to suck. I'll tell you what we're going to do, though. Let's go with, um... Let's go with the one that gives us more life with the stim canisters. Stim potency increased. That's what I'm talking about. And then we'll save. All right, guys, we're going to wrap up this episode. Uh, we will, as usual, pick up right where we left off in the next episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, and share out the video, and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.